Hey gang, uh, this is a video to show you how to draw a line of best fit on scatter plots. So if you look at this first image here, you see a scatter plot with the line of best fit already drawn in. And we're going to look at this just to give you some hints about how to approach this problem. So first of all, you see um, that there is a negative correlation, and you see that because the dots appear to be sloping down. So you know that your line of best fit is also going to slope down. The other thing you want to do is you want to get your line in the middle of all of the dots and if possible get the line to touch as many dots as possible. Now you might have a line of best fit that, that does not touch any dots and that's, that's perfectly okay because the first priority is to get it in the middle of all the dots, right? Because you're thinking of a line of best fit as the average line, okay? And if, if you have the added bonus that the, the line goes through some of the dots, then that's great. Recall we're not starting from 0, 0. We're starting from where the data begins, and we're ending where the data ends. So don't feel uh, obliged to start at the uh, 0, 0. And the final tip is to use the correlation value. So if you're given a correlation value of negative 0.001, then you know that's going to be extremely weak correlation. You might as well say no correlation. And that's going to be a horizontal line. So let the correlation value also give you a clue. For the duration of this video, we're going to do some together. So I'll show you a scatter plot. Then you imagine the line of best fit. And then I'll show you the line of best fit. Okay, so let's start with this first one. So why don't you draw the line of best fit. Use your finger on the screen. And then I'll show you mine. Well, the first clue is the R value. The correlation of 0 0.1 is a weak correlation or no correlation. So I know it's probably going to be a horizontal line. And then if I just look at my dots, they don't look like they're sloping up or down. So I'm just going to put my line straight across, get half of those points above, half of those points below, and I'm done. Let's go on to the next one. How about this one? So this is going to be a positive correlation, no R value, but we see that it's slanting up. It's probably a, a medium positive correlation, and we're going to put our line right here. We got half our points above, half our points below, and we're done. Let's go on to the next one. Again, no R value, but we see it's clearly sloping down. This is uh, a medium to high correlation. They seem clustered. Ignore some of these outliers, and here's the line. 